All right, I believe it's on. I want to say all praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rekahakadash. Okay? And uh, again, all like always, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. All right? Uh, it's the brother, Gabar Adama. <laughs> sort of hard to say, but yeah, uh, I've been, uh, I'm, you know, I'm no longer a part, as of right now, you know, I'm no longer a part of uh, GMS. Um, you know, and it's nothing. Look, I got to say this first and foremost. To the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, <laughs> there's no other doctrine. There's no other doctrine out there. So anybody who may be listening, there is no other doctrine out there. GMS has 100% truth. Okay. I just got to put that out there. 100% truth. And it is what it is. Okay, uh, I need to examine myself, all right, just like the scripture says, uh, going back and forth with brothers on comment boards, <laughs> something, I, something that I shouldn't have done, and, uh, you know, I do realize the error, the error in my way, okay, I just wanted to, I just wanted to put that out there. So I'm going to get a couple scriptures. This is uh, 1 Corinthians 14, 40. Let all things be done decently and in order. Okay? So, you know, just like the scripture said, let everything be done decently and in order. And not just apparently, I do know that, I, you know, yep, I went off. I went off, right? So, you know, like I said, it is what it is. But uh, the words will not depart from my mouth. You know, this is uh, the the father chastised his sons, you know. So let's get this. This is 2 Corinthians 13 in verse 5. Uh, it, uh, verse 5, it says, examine yourselves, whether ye be in the faith, prove your own selves. Okay. So I'm, I'm getting, I'm gonna get on my own self. Prove your own selves. Know ye, uh, your own selves, how that uh, Hamashiach is in you, except ye be reprobates. Okay. But I trust that ye shall know that we are not reprobates. All right. So, you know, the spirit speak expressly. And this is, you know, this is also to the brother uh, Manat Zakbar. Powerful, vigilant brother, man. And I absolutely, I love every one of y'all, man. I love every one uh, of you GMS brothers, man. And it'll always be that way. It'll never change. Never change. Okay? In all truth and sincerity, that uh, that's, uh, I'm just being honest. Okay? Proverbs 9 and 8. Reprove not a scorner, lest he hate thee. Rebuke a wise man, and he will love thee. Okay? So that that's a serious scripture. Rebuke. A wise man and he will love thee. All right. Let me keep going. Because, you know, like I said, and I'm going to say it again. Brothers, I'll be going back and forth and uh, sowing discord amongst each other, man. It's, it's just wrong. Okay. What I did was wrong. And uh, I'm, a, I'm a big enough man to admit that. I tell you that right now. Ain't going to be no effeminate garbage because I'm I'm a man about it. All right. You got to stay in the spirit. All praise to you. How about Shimmy Hava Shai? Okay, this is, uh, let's get this. This is Proverbs 27, verse 5. Let's start at 4. Wrath is cruel, and anger is, uh, uh, out, and anger is outrageous. But who is able to stand before envy? Okay, 5. Open rebuke is better than secret love. All right, 6. Faithful are the uh, are the wounds, Salakia. Faithful are the wounds of a friend, but the kisses of an enemy are deceitful. Okay, seven, the full soul soul loatheth and honeycomb, but to the hungry soul, bitter thing is sweet. All right, so yeah, you know, open rebuke is better. It's better than secret love. 
You got you got to take it. You got to take this word. You got to eat the whole roll and run with it, man. Run with it. Okay. This is Hebrews 12 verse 5. And ye have forgotten the exhortation which speaketh unto you, uh, which speaketh unto you as children, my son, despise not thou the chastising of of the Lord, okay? Nor faint when thou art rebuked of him. Six, for whom the Lord loveth, he chastiseth and scourges every son whom he receiveth. Okay? That's a, that's a, that's a deep scripture right there. Seven, if ye endure chastising, Yahweh dealeth with you. And as with sons, for what son is he whom the father chastised not? Okay? Uh, this is verse 8. But if ye be without chastisement, whereof all partakers, then are ye bastards and not sons. 9. Furthermore, we have had fathers of our flesh which corrected us. See? You see, this is a, this this one right here. This hit, it really hits home for me, right about now. Okay. Nine. Furthermore, we have had fathers of our flesh, which corrected us, and we give them reverence. This is why we say double honors to the runs uh, to the apostles who, who rule well, man, and the elders. Okay, and we gave them reverence. Shall we? Shall we not be? Slaki, shall we not much rather be in subjection under the Father's spirits and live? <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> the ten, verse ten says. Oh, sorry, Slaki, I'm a little, little bit parched right now. For they verily, a few days chastised chastised us after their own pleasure, but he, for our profit, that we might be partakers of his holiness. Okay? So, yeah. You know, uh, like the brothers at Great Millstone do, you know, which as of right now, I'm, you know, no longer a part of, but, uh, but I definitely uh, uh, will not depart from the doctrine, man, because uh, the two can't walk together unless they agree. Okay? You know, and, and that's what it is. And I'll, and I'll never, I'll never depart from the 100% doctrine okay 100 percent all right so this is uh this is job this is job 5 17 behold happy is the man whom yahweh correcteth therefore despise not the chastising of the almighty there it is boom uh, 18 for he uh, he, for, uh Salakia, for he maketh sore and bindeth up he woundeth and his hands make whole okay uh, uh precept to that would be uh, Isaiah 45 and 7 I believe uh 19 he shall deliver thee in six troubles yea in seven there shall be no evil touch thee all right so yeah, man, you know, I gotta uh, like the first scripture, I gotta examine myself and stay strong in the spirit, man. Under you how about Simi Shai? Okay? And that's and then you know it is what it is. So let's go to You know, and if uh and I, I gotta say this too, if you know if I offended anyone, of of course, you know, I know I went off. That was what I did, I shouldn't have done. All right. But if I offend anyone, uh, you know, I say, uh, uh, Salaki for that. All right. This is Proverbs three, verse 11. My son despise not the chastising of the Lord, Yahweh, our power. Okay. Neither be weary of his correction. For whom the Lord loveth, he correcteth. Even as our father, the son, in whom he delighteth. Okay. 
13. Happy is the man that findeth wisdom and the man that getteth understanding. Okay? So, yeah, I mean, this is brothers and sisters, man. Brothers, we are we are extremely lucky to be able to understand and break down these scriptures, man. Regardless, regardless of anything, man, you know, two thirds Two thirds are never going to be able to hear this word, man. So, yeah, uh, uh, I say to Wada Yahabashim Yahashah for giving me understanding in the first place. All right. For waking me up and uh, and changing me from out of that, all that wicked and craziness that I was doing when I was in the world, man. You know, and, uh, all praise goes to Yahabashim Yahashah. And, you know, that is what it is. OK, so. Let's go to. Uh, Sirach 2 and verse 5. Or Ecclesiasticus 2 verse 5. Uh, let's see here. Start at 1. My son, if thou come to serve the Lord, prepare thyself for temptation. 2. Set thine heart aright and constantly endure Make not haste in the time of trouble. Three, cleave unto him and depart not away, that thou mayest be increased at thy last end. Okay, so yeah, man, uh, we can't, we can, I cannot let, I cannot let, we cannot let the brothers who understand this cannot let anything get in the way of that. Okay, cannot let anything get in the way of that. Pray always, okay? Verse 4. Whosoever is brought upon thee cheerfully and be patient when thou art changed to a low estate. <laughs> I got to read that again. You know, hey, these these words, hey, these words are hit, they're hitting me hard, especially today. It's a tough video to make, brothers and sisters. I just got to be honest with you. I ain't going to lie. And I ain't gonna get in my feelings neither. That just uh, that ain't me. You take it like a man, you move on. Okay. Uh, four. Whosoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully. Uh, uh, Salakia. Whatsoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully, and be patient when thou art changed to a low estate. Okay. Five. For gold is tried in the fire, and acceptable. Men in the furnace of adversity. All right. Believe in him and he will help thee. Order thy way aright and trust in him. Ye that fear the Lord. So lucky I just got a message. Uh, ye that fear the Lord, wait for his mercy and go and go not aside lest ye fail. All right. Eight. Ye that fear the Lord, believe him. And your reward shall not fail. Let me read that one more time. Eight. Ye that fear the Lord, believe him, and your reward shall not fail. Okay. That's the last scripture I had up, but uh, let me, I got to read this. I got to read this. You see, the because, the, you know, the fear of the Lord is beginning of wisdom, you know? So... Salaki, brothers. Salaki. Yeah. Here we go. Uh, Proverbs 1 to 7. The fear of the Lord, our power, is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise and hate instruction. Okay? All right? So, yeah. I just, you know, I just want to make this quick video and let everybody know, you know, what was going on with me and, and why it happened. And I completely understand. Like I said, I ain't gonna get in my feelings at all. All right, because this uh the path is uh it's 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 straight and narrow. <laughs> all right, it's straight and narrow, man. And uh, it's uh you know somewhat melancholy, but you know it's you know it is what it is. It really is. It is what it is. I want to say all praise to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Rekah Hakodash. All right, double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone. All right, okay. 
Ababa Ball to this place. Shalom.